and welcome back to my channel. So the reason I'm starting this video off in the restroom is because I am deciding to film a 24 hours with a newborn. My baby will be two weeks tomorrow. He has his two week checkup tomorrow. He's also going to be able to meet his grandparents tomorrow, which is really exciting. I'm not sure if we're gonna film that uh, just because it is a very sentimental moment for um, our parents, they have been waiting to meet him and they're finally gonna be able to meet him. I did just get out of the shower. I got ready for bed. Now I'm going to go and change Ryze's diaper and feed him. I've been trying to pump so that I have bottles for nighttime because I feel like it'll be easier. So tonight I'm gonna uh, try while I'm, he's bottle feeding on my breast pump um, and see how well that works. So at night he'll be bottle feeding and during the day he'll be breastfeeding I feel like that'll be a little bit easier on me and it'll let me get a little bit more sleep so it is currently 12 o'clock in the morning and our time starts now it's my sleepy baby he's getting a little bit where well, he's waking up I have to keep gloves on him because he scratches his face so bad I hate seeing those scratch marks on oh. him now was that necessary mm, yeah. <laughs> did you hear what daddy the sound daddy made <gasps> Yeah. <laughs> His daddy wanted to lay with him before I woke him up. Well, uh, why are you gonna wake him up? It looks so funny. I actually have to take my medicine. Uh, I did get prescribed a lot of medication. I actually finished one, but I'm still taking um, like four different medications. Um, and then while I do that, I was just gonna tell you guys, I found that it's easier to wake him up every two hours. Like me wake him up like by changing him and then feeding him. It keeps him from crying as much. It's usually when babies wake up and they start crying, it's like an indication that they're super hungry. I like to try keep up with the two hour mark so that he doesn't go super hungry and they start crying. Because it's really hard whenever he's crying to get him to latch onto my breast because he's so mad that he just doesn't want to cooperate. Okay, so I'm about to unswaddle him. This is when he's gonna wake up and he gets really mad he hates diaper changes but that's how i wake him up for his feedings his diaper change there we go my love oh my goodness he just doesn't like the diaper changes He's calming down a little bit, but he's looking for the nipple, which means it's time to feed him. He is feeding and falling asleep. Okay, now he's back in his bassinet and sleeping. Hopefully he stays asleep. He usually likes to sleep in mine or his dad's arms, so sometimes he'll wake up and get fussy just because he wants to be with us. Okay, so it's 1 o'clock in the morning. I'm going to go ahead and enjoy a glass of milk and try to get some sleep before I have to wake up again. You wanna say goodnight? Night. Good night. see you guys in a few hours. Hello, it's three o'clock in the morning. Jay went ahead and changed his diaper and now he's bottle feeding him while I'm gonna pump really quick. Okay, so I just finished pumping and Tell baby, this face. baby just finished his bottle. Oh my goodness, now he's getting burped by his daddy because that's something Jay is really good at also, is burping. He's good at swaddling, changing his diaper, burping. <laughs> I'm just good at breastfeeding. <laughs> that's all I have. <laughs> I got the rest, <laughs> Okay, so it's around 3.40 and baby is already sleeping on his dad's chest. So I went ahead and soaked his pump parts for a little bit and now I'm gonna wash his pump. <laughs> Now it is about time for us to go back to sleep and I will be starting my day off at 6 so I will see you guys in a little bit. It is currently 6.50. I have already changed his diaper. I put on a new pair of clothes for him and he has already ate. Now as you can tell he's dozing off back to sleep. And he actually ended up waking up again around like 4.30. So in total, I probably got about two and a half hours of sleep, which was fine. 
and just before I got some type of sleep. I'm gonna give him a few minutes to just relax before I put him in his bassinet and then I'm gonna get ready for the day. I went ahead and got dressed. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and do my morning hygiene stuff. We are on the way to the doctor's. <laughs> so it is after the appointment, I completely blanked out and I was so focused on his appointment that I didn't record anything. But they said, it, it, huh? <laughs> it's 9.40, Jay, Jay wanted y'all to know. <laughs> um, <laughs> but um, everything looks good. My baby's getting bigger. His, um, uh, I don't think I told you guys, but his umbilical cord fell off yesterday. So we're gonna be able to give him a bath today. So my baby has a lot of milestones today. He's two weeks. He's gonna take his first bath today, and he's meeting his grandparents. I know, and he's just healthy and beautiful and smart and handsome and everything. Look at him. <laughs> Update: So we have made it home. Baby is in his bassinet. He is kind of moving around right now, but he is sleeping. We stopped by Chick-fil-A. I got myself a frosted coffee. And I just pumped a good three ounces. Jay put on Tokyo Drift. And I'm probably going to watch with him for a little bit and then try to just catch a nap. So it's currently 4.30. All Baby has really done in the past four hours is eat, sleep, repeat, change diapers. Oh, well, really? That's what you have to do. But we're getting him ready for his first bath. So he can be ready to meet his grandparents in a little bit. We just got done with his first shower, his first bath. They put a little heating pad under his towel for him so he wouldn't be as cold. I'm now getting my baby dressed and ready. Because he needs to look so presentable. Oh my goodness. Look at him. He scratched his face real bad because he was upset about the bath. But he's dressed. We just have to comb his hair and I'm gonna feed him really quick. Right to Bubba. My my love. It's currently 9.30 and my baby just ate. He has already met everybody. I know he's exhausted. He has not really been able to sleep in the past three hours. Okay guys, so I think that's gonna be it for today's video. It's already around 10 o'clock and I'm gonna go ahead and try to get some sleep before baby wakes up. I do have to take medicine at 12, so I'm going to be waking him up around 12 to feed him. With that being said, thank you guys so much for watching my video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.